Hello everybody, this is Mr. Catcom again with my Gundam review and today I am reviewing the what is this? 1100 Master Grade Destiny Gundam. Now this is my first Master Grade and I will say this is the best Gundam I have made um, Master Grade wise because it's my first one but it looks so sweet. Big extended win uh, wings back and forth. And the anti ship sword is friggin' huge. It actually is at least half an inch taller than the actual model. Uh, I guess without wings, because when I did it, I didn't have the wings built. Um, it comes with the sword in the back. I didn't have room to put the, the beam rifle in the back, but um, that's going into my uh, weapon graveyard. But um, I custom painted his, um, I guess his hand. I don't know how to get it to autofocus, but we can see that it's not the regular gray, but it's a chrome silver from uh, Tamaya. Best paint ever I'm using on um, a couple of kits. I'm actually going to finish coloring the joints right here and right over here. Chrome silver. Try to make it match kind of like the um, uh, extreme burst mode on the wings. I don't know if you can see it. I know it's kind of blurry, but right here on the wings. I colored the hydraulic pieces, um, chrome silver as well. Um, I still need to panel line this guy, he's still kind of naked. I did panel line the face, which probably can't see, but panel line that. Um, overall, I give this model like a 10 out of 10 if I had to give it a number. It's really, really nice. Came with a lot of pieces. Master grades are really, um, time consuming now because of the fact that it's uh I don't know I guess because it's more detailed but um the biggest thing that I saw was like the leg or like the arm itself had like at least 20 pieces in it um great articulation even though I usually try to steer away from that um the wings let me see if I can bring it back some more the wings are pretty huge it came with a, a stand which justifies the fifty dollar and eighty cent uh, price tag. You figure you're paying like ten dollars for the stand anyway. Um, it's made out of plastic. I haven't had. I got them in like in this like I'm about to jump and do my uh, chrome fist on you, whatever. And then it's gonna slash you. So that's what the story is like. But it is really really sweet. I will probably uh, go ahead and uh, panel line it later. But for right now, it looks real sweet the way it is now. Um, I spray painted the red, the black, um, the blue, blue right there, and most of all the red parts. Uh, I sprayed them with all metallic paint from my uh, Tamaya. That's like my, I'm going to be a Tamaya spokesperson. <laughs> um, and gunmetal for the the top over here, right there. Um, I didn't paint line the boomerang shield pieces. They come off and turn into the, um, the little boomerang. And I got a blade that goes inside there, but I didn't use it. Um, other than that, pretty good kit. Definitely worth it if you like the winged Gundams. I've never owned a Master Grade. And I've never owned a um, Wing Gundam. So don't bark at me if you say uh, like Wing Gundam uh, is the best. And I'm saying like this is the best because this is my first Master Grade. Um, other than that, I really like this. So um, like. Like always, you can view the high-res pics on my blog at mrcatcomds.blogspot.com. Send me an email, um, subscribe, subscribe, and I actually try to have a bunch of voting polls on my uh, blog, so go up there to vote, and I um, hope you like this review. All right.